this in plant in class 6 you learn that food is essential for all living organism you also learn that carbohydrate protein fats vitamin and minerals are component of food these component of food are called nutrients and are necessary for our body all living organism require food plants can synthesize food for themselves but animal including humans cannot they get it from plants or animals that eat plants thus humans and animals are directly or indirectly dependent on plants bojo wants to know how plants prepare their own food mode of nutrition in plant plants are the only organism that can prepare food for themselves by using water carbon dioxide and minerals the raw material are present in their surroundings the nutrients enable living organism to build their bodies to grow to repair damage part of their bodies and provide the energy to carry out life process nutrition is the mode of taking food by an organism and it's utilized by the body the mode of nutrition in which organism make food themselves from simple substance is called autotrophic auto self drops nutrients mint auto nutrition therefore plant are called autotrophs animal and most other organisms take in food prepared by plant they are called heterotrophs hetero others pehli want to now why our body cannot make food from carbon dioxide and water and minerals like plant do now we may ask where to the food factories of plant are located whether food is made in all parts of a plant or only in certain parts how do plants obtain the raw material from the surroundings how do they transport them to the food factories of plant photosynthesis food making process in plant leaves are the food factor uh, factories of plant therefore all the raw material must reach the leaf water and minerals present in the soil are absorbed by the root and transport to the leaves carbon dioxide from air is taken in says you have seen the buildings are made of bricks similarly the bodies of living organism are made of tiny units called cells cells can be seen only under the microscope some organism are made of only one cell the cell is enclosed by a thin outer boundary called the cell membrane most cell have distinct centrally located spherical structures called nucleus the nucleus is surrounded by a jelly like substance called cytoplasm cells cell membrane cytoplasma nucleus through the tiny pores present on the surface of leaves these pores are surrounded by guard cell such pore are called stomata bujo want to know how water and mineral absorbed by root reach the leaves water and mineral are transported to the leaves by the vessels which run like pipes throughout the root the stem the branches and the leaves they form a continuous path or passage for the nutrients to reach the leaf they are called vessels you will learn more about transport of material in plants in chapter 7 pehli want to know what is so special about the leaves that they can synthesize food but other parts of the plant cannot 
द लीव्स हैव ग्रीन पिगमेंट कॉल्ड क्लोरोफिल इट हेल्प्स लीव्स टू कैप्चर द एनर्जी ऑफ सनलाइट दिस एनर्जी इज यूज टू सिंथेथाइज प्रिपेयर फूड फॉर्म कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड एंड वाटर सिंस द सिंथेथाइज ऑफ फूड अखाउर इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ सनलाइट इट इज कॉल्ड फोटो सिंथेथिस फोटो लाइट सिंथेथिस टू कंबाइन सो वी फाइंड दैट क्लोरोफिल सनलाइट कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड एंड वाटर आर नेसेसरी टू कैरी आउट द प्रोसेस ऑफ फोटो सिंथेथिस इट इज यूनिक प्रोसेस ऑन द अर्थ द सोलर सिस्टम इज कैप्चर बाय द लीव्स एंड स्टोर इन द प्लांट इन द फॉर्म ऑफ फूड द सन इज द द अल्टीमेट सोर्स ऑफ एनर्जी फॉर ऑल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म कैन यू इमेजिन लाइफ ऑन अर्थ इन द अबसेंस ऑफ फोटो सिंथेथिस इन द अबसेंस ऑफ फोटो सिंथेथिस देयर वुड नॉट बी एनी फूड द सर्वाइवल ऑफ ऑलमोस्ट ऑल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म डायरेक्टली ऑन डायरेक्टली डिपेंड्स ओपन द फूड मेड बाय द प्लांट्स बिसाइड ऑक्सीजन विच इज एजेंशियल फॉर सर्वाइवल Beside leaves, photosynthesis also takes place in other green parts of the plant. In green stem and green branches, the desert plant have scale, spine-like leaves to reduce loss of water by transpiration. These plants have green stem which carry out photosynthesis. Light energy, carbon dioxide, oxygen. of all organism is produced during photosynthesis in the absence of photosynthesis life would be impossible on earth during photosynthesis chlorophyll containing cell of leaves in the presence of sunlight use carbon dioxide and water to synthesize carbohydrate the pores can be present, represented in in equations carbon dioxide plus water sunlight chlorophyll carbohydrate plus oxygen chlorophyll guard cell stomata section of leaf guard cell leaf stomata opening stomata during the process oxygen is released the presence of starch in leaves indicate the occurrence of photosynthesis starch is also the carbohydrate bojo has observed some plant with help red violet or brown leaves he want to know whether these leaves also carry out photosynthesis take two pot, uh, potted plant of the same kind keep one in the dark or in black box for 72 hours and other in sunlight perform iodine test with the leaves of both the plant as you did in class 6 record your result now leave the pot which was earlier kept in the dark in the sunlight for 3 4 days and perform the iodine test again on its leaves record your observations in your notebook the leaves other than green also have chlorophyll the large amount of red brown and other pigment mask the green color photosynthesis take place in these leaves also leaves of various color you often see slimy green patches in pound or stay stigmen water bodies these are generally formed by the growth of organism called algae can you guess why algae are green in color they contain chlorophyll which gives them the green color algae can also also prepare their own food by photosynthesis synthesis of plant food other than carbohydrate you have just learned that plant synthesizes carbohydrate through the process of photosynthesis the the carbohydrate are made of carbon uh, hydrogen oxygen these are used to synthesize other component of food such as the protein and fat but pro but protein uh, are nitrogenous substance which contain nitrogen from where due to the plants obtain nitrogen recall that nitrogen is present in the abundance in gases from in the air heavier plant cannot absorb nitrogen in the in this 
this form soil has certain bacteria that convert gases nitrogen into usable form and release in into the soil these are absorbed by the plants along with water also you might have seen formal adding fertilizer rich in nitrogen to the soil in this way the plant fulfill their requirement of nitrogen along with the other cons uh, constituent plants can them synthesize protein and vitamins other modes of nutrition in plant there are there are some plants which do not have chlorophyll they cannot synthesize food how do they survive and from where do they drive nutrition like humans and animals such plant depend on the food produced by other plant they use the heterotrophic mode of nutrition look at figure 1.52 you see yellow spiry branches structures twine around the stem and branches of a tree this is a plant called costica umbrella it does not have a chlorophyll it takes ready made food from the plant on which it is a climbing the plant on which is climbed is called a host since it derived a host of valuable nutrients costica is called as a parasite rb and other animals also a kind of parasite you should think about it and discuss with your teacher here which uh, which are uh, which are direct downward when an insect land in the pincher the late closed and uh, trapped insect get in gained into the hair the late closed and the insect is tap the insect is dead by the digestive juices secretion in the pinches and its nutrients are absorbed such insect eating plants are called insective wars plant it is possible that such plant do not get all the required nutrients from the soil in which they grow Bojo is a confused if the pitcher plant is green and carries out photosynthesis then why does it feed on insect led pehli want to know whether mosquito cute bed bugs lice and leeches that stuck our blood are also parasite have you seen or heard of plant that can eat animals there are few plants which can trap insect and digest them it is not amazing such plant may be green of some other color look at the plant of figure 1.6 the pincher like so judge uh, jug like structure is a modified part of leaf the apex of the leaf form the pincher like so just like structure is the modified part of leaf the apex of the leaf form a lid which can open and close the mouth of the pincher inside the pincher there are there are pincher plant showing lid picture leaf modify into the pincher saprophytes you might have seen the packets of mushroom sold in the vegetable <coughs> market you may have also seen fully fe umbrella like patches growing in moisty soils or rooting food during the rainy seasons 1.7 let us find out what types of nutrients they need to survive and form uh, from where they get them packet of mushrooms a mushroom growing on decayed materials bojo want to know how these organism acquire bojo want to now how these organism acquire nutrients they do not have mouth like animals do they are not like green plant as they lack chlorophyll and cannot make food by photosynthesis take a piece of bread and moist it with water leaves and moist form place for 2 to 3 days until full fill patches appear on them what is the color of these patches observe the patches under a microscopes or magnify glasses write down your observation in the notebook you will be see cotton like thread spread on the piece of fungi growing on bread these organism 